What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we are back in Scrap Mechanic. I want to thank everyone for all the love and support on the series. If you enjoy these videos, hit that like button. Comes out my channel ever so much more than you know. It feels good in some ways to start building again in Scrap Mechanic, but in most ways, it reminds me of a uh, reminds me of things sometimes things uh, don't change when it comes to crashing. <laughs> I have so many problems, and mostly it's because I scroll through, I have a bunch of, uh, I basically have all the derf mods loaded, and if you start going through your parts list, it can get very dire, hold on, mistakes have been made, what's happening, there we go, <laughs> if you scroll, if you have a bunch of mods loaded and you scroll through the thing like real fast, oh, it's going to give you some problems, and it's going to create like this dump crash that uh, puts you in the dumps. You know what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying? Yeah, you guys get what I'm saying. It's pretty rough. Oh, I like that. I like that. I like that. Hollow wheel. Some of these parts I haven't really <laughs> even noticed because I've been too busy trying to get this done as quickly as possible. But I done built something. Just to kind of get back into the mix, back into the fray of things. Oh, yeah. I didn't know what to call it. So I called it the Diesel Ro- uh, not the Diesel Rover, but the Diesel Roller. <laughs> it says, uh, basically every single derf mod, uh, imaginable. Front end also has MJM Sci-Fi mod and this Exhaust Pipes mod, which gives you metallic exhaust pipes and it's fantastic. Especially if you're trying to build a car, anyone has some fancy, fancy schmancy exhaust. I like the, has a look at the, uh, the brackets, the fasteners, kind of make it think that you're not, that you're not like, uh, your pipes aren't free balling in the wind. Not connecting anything. Free balling? Diesel? Free balling? Yeah, yeah. You said it. I said it. You said it. I said it. Together, <laughs> we can uh, we can get through this together. Don't knock until you try it, kids. We also have a track light that goes all on the front. Two engines that go and connect to these four wheels. Both these wheels are nine by seven. Nine by seven? No, no, no. They're not nine by seven. They're like eleven by six. Um, because everything is even Stevens. Yeah. But I wanted to try and build something to get into the whole pistones. And uh, the pistones, they, uh, the way that I can kind of like, figure out how to work them is by making doors. Now, when you've been trying to make doors or even just sliding doors back in the old scrap mechanic, you had to get like three joints and then get a controller and then make sure they're even, even Steven. Yeah, 11 to 6. I have, all these wheels are 11 to 6. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Got a suspension going on double double suspension, which is fastened into the back there, as well as one single suspension, and it looks like it's getting crushed. You're crushing me. Uh oh, a little squeaky. Ah, squeakaroo! With two miniguns that don't fire. <laughs> it's all all this is aesthetic. Um I was trying to figure out how to uh, get these to work and then realize that these never really work to begin with. Trying to press E to use. I know. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to. Ha huh, ha. Huh. What, 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 what's, what's happening here? But anyway, it's a roller vehicle. It also has an anti flip mechanism where the suspension glitch obviously doesn't seem to work anymore. They kind of get rid of it, and that's fine. But um, it's still a pain in the butt to try and keep this thing on its toes. So I got sensors that go up to thrusters on the top. So that way, if we do get a little gangster lean going, the thrusters will kind of kick it back in back onto the ground. I also have a bunch of thrusters on the booty along with the sensor up top in case it does flip on its back. Then it'll shoot you back up on to your wheels. Then you're off again. With a bunch of lights too. Camera action. So what do you say we get in this joint? So when I said I wanted to make a door from a piston, we have one sensor here, one sensor to rule them all. Ah, the neon. It, the neon turns on too as you lower down in you lower the cockpit down. Also has a place for your secondary dude to hang out, your your, your buddy, and y'all can go ahead and straight roll through here. We have some controllers and some LCD screens in the center. One piston drags everybody up, and then when you hit one, it turns these uh, lights, the neon bars off. But if you want to have them back on again, because kids get scared of the dark, you can hit the two button, and boom, you got some lights. Oh yeah, I missed the switch. Dang it. What? That's okay. Now the th 
The four button is really for the LED lights in case you want to make a different design on it. You can go ahead and hit that. I'm not going to do it now because I like the way the design looks. All right, meow. And uh, I don't want to screw it up. So uh, that's what we got going. So one brings us down. Two turns off the lights. But if you turn this back off, it turns the lights automatically off. Let's turn them back up. Up, oh, up, oh, hood, hood. And two will bring them back on again. Oh, yeah. And I wanted to have them all flicker, kind of like that, where it wouldn't all be uniform. Kind of like a fluorescent light where it kind of uh, turns on from one side, but then it doesn't turn on on the other side, man. You know what I mean? You guys get upset. So, uh, also, the uh, bunch of lights. That would be the five switch. Boom. We got lights everywhere, baby. We got lights for days, baby. And then WASD to roll. Turning can kind of be a pain. We got to see. Anti-flip. Anti-flip, sir. The wheels kind of bug out from time to time. I'm not even going to lie. I don't even know what's going on with that. Oh. Oh. We're fine, though. No, no, we're good. Let's reverse it. The wheel is flaking out, man. Hey, man. <laughs> I got a derpy wheel. It's like, hey man, can we just can we turn this right? There we go. Oh yeah. Oh oh oh. You think think you bad? You think you bad? Oh no. Turtle on his back in the sun. Turtle on his back in the sun. All right. So adjustments must be made. Where's our sensor? Oh, you guys get to see it the uh, tippy top. So this. It looks like a whale floundering. <laughs> you know, sometimes I just try too hard. There we go. Hey, buddy. You know, things are not meant to be perfect. There we go. Hmm. Maybe I'll put a button there. Maybe that can help out. Hold on. Oh, hold your horses. Hey, man. <laughs> so, obviously, the sensor is not working. So, let's go ahead and we'll try to redo it here. Did I miss something? I did miss something over here. Hold on. Go slowly, slowly through the menu, slowly through the menu, or else bad things will happen. Bad things. Bad things, Mikey. Bad things. Go ahead, and we were either a six wedge or an eight wedge. Six wedge? Oh, are you a good witch or a bad witch? Uh, and then we'll help up to the sci-fi button. Ha ha, button. I have a feeling if we just drop a button on it and keep it pressed down, because allowing the sensor to try and lift it up, that ain't gonna fly. That ain't gonna fly, baby. That's fine. Sometimes things don't work. Most times for me, things don't work at all. Uh, where you at? Where you at? Where you at, tiger? There you are. No, we just need a button. 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 Uh, but first things first. Oh, hey, look, you know. <laughs> it dropped down for me. Uh, what is the size? What is the size of you? Yo, what's the size of you? Six? You look like a six to me. Could that be true? Bugaboo. Boom. Wrong. Oh, perfect. Wrong. <laughs> Everything's wrong. Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey. Shh. Okay. So, to lift this up, I also realized that when I had this drop down, that even if I were to hop out of here, I'd still be stuck inside. So, I was like, well, then I got to make a hatch. So, one will lift you back up. The three switch will open up the top hatch here and allow you to get out the top because it is not meant to be. So, you. I'm done with you. I'm done with you. Now, the only problem is, is that in order to get back in, you gotta hop back over here. Ah, uh, all right. So, we need another button. 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 Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, these uh, neon bars are really cool and all, but uh, yeah, they uh, take up a lot of space in your HUD. Bud, bud. Boom. Take you, we'll drop you there, and then, right, one, 
Beautiful. You know, I'm I'm trying to kind of like uh, get all the the, the uh, what are they called? Um, go ahead and connect. The uh, logic gates. I'm not a logic expert by any stretch of the imagination, so I'm just doing my best of what I can. I know there's probably like a one button does all for everything, but uh, not that bright. So, just had to make do with what we got. And so far, I think it looks okay. And it works okay. So now, hopefully when we flip on over. Nah, we're, we'll be fine. So now, hopefully, when it flips on over, we can just flip it back. Let's give it a whirl. Off we go. Yeah. It's trying. I'm floundering. I'm floundering, man. All right. Oh yeah. Or a break dancer. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Just get over the right. This isn't really a rock crawler. I wasn't making this to be a rock crawler. I, the, the the wheels. Why why you, you hurt me so good? Why you hurt so good? Come on. You can do it. Some modifica modifications are needed. You know? Modifications are necessary. On a flat ground, flat world, like a modular, like on a moon world, on a moon, on a moon planet, you may have yourself a little bit of a deal here. I just wanted to make something long, long, and kind of get the friction on. Okay, so the steering is correct. It's probably just not all that hot. That's all. That's all the problem is. There we go. We're working on it. It's all a work in progress. I just wish it would uh, stabilize when, like, the wheels. Like, why do you go that way? You know you want to go the way that I want you to go. You know where I want you to go, man. Oh no! Oh no! So, almost. We're close. Nailed it. Feeling good about it. There we go, finally. You know what? Sometimes it just takes a little effort. And I'm all about the, giving that E for effort. That is for sure. Dang, son. <laughs> so for the most part, it kind of works. The stabilizers, they uh, they do what they can. But I do like the exhaust system that comes with like the, uh, the the metal pipes mod. Yeah, this, this wheel, this whole wheel, John, has got gotta, to gotta retweak that. That is not that is not the best. Let's go ahead. We'll hop on out of here. I do like the lights though. It's one of my crowning achievements. Yeah, because I have the uh, the things are just twist right right there. So I don't know. Maybe it's just maybe it's just glitchy. Maybe it's just because I have so many uh, different blocks going on. Maybe I just got a, a bunch of the weight. You know, most of these are all lightweight polygon. Uh, parts and uh, this is uh, ultra lightweight and the other one is just super lightweight so maybe it just doesn't have the weight needed although it is given pretty good maybe if we tone maybe if we tone down the weight the resistance the res resistance <laughs> uh, it could possibly help with the turning Although, I've been wrong before. Not gonna be the first time. Won't be the last. It's not that bad. It's okay. It's okay. Just flakes out of, flakes out from time to time. Just like me. Hey! Hey! But still, I think it's a pretty cool build. Just needed to get some, uh... Get, yeah, gotta get the motions down. Gotta get back into the swing of things. And I just tried to... I mainly went for the artistic route before I actually went to go into the functional route, so... It's kind of alright. It's kind of okay. And I like it. And I hope you all do too. If you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button. If you enjoyed this uh, creation, leave a comment in the comment section down below of what you thought about it. Oh yeah. All oh, those wheels.
all those wheels. Maybe give me a hint, tip, or trick on how to fix this. <laughs> but it also, the uh, link for the download is in the description down below. So if you fix it yourself, and just go, look at what I did. And I'd be like, oh my god, just check that out. And hop on into Discord, and, uh, and share it. Share it with the creations. It's forever a work in progress. Forever a work in progress. I'm telling you what. I'll tell you what? Hey, folks! Oh, come on. That's kind of nifty, though. Forget trying to forget trying to knock this out in uh, first-person view. That will not be happening for you. There we go. Fantastic. Beautiful, man. Beautiful. So, everyone, um, if, like I said, leave a comment, download it, and then hop into the Discord and share if you uh, modified it. I would love to see it. And then we'll hop into a video of you, actually, uh, of your creation and how you fixed it because uh I, like i said all i went for is the aesthetic route and it's uh sort of functional kind of sort of not really kind of not really kind of mm, for me but everyone <laughs> uh thank you so much for checking out the video have a great day afternoon evening whoa 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 have a great day afternoon evening a good night peace out like shout y'all and I will check you out right here again in Scrap Mechanic next time. Put on the lights. Camera action. Sorry, Miss Jackson. Booyah. <laughs>